What's going on there, friends? My name is M Shanted Your Eights, and welcome to Danganronpa Trigger Happy Havoc for the PC. This game is also available on PlayStation 4. Um, you guys have never expected me to play this type of game, ever. And, uh, well, here we are. Um, I have never really played this type of game before. Um, which is, which means that this LP is completely blind. Um, I, although I have been watching people stream this game blind on Twitch, and, uh, th that doesn't mean I've analyzed the game very closely, nor have I paid much attention. Uh, all I know is that it looked really interesting. So I thought I wanted I might I wanted to give this game a try. And so here I am. And I think this would be a good game to try out because uh I have not done a blind let's play in a very very long time. Like most LP most of my recent LPs have been have been close to blind but not completely blind. Like I've done semi blind LPs as of recently. Uh, but this will be a completely blind LP. There will be no guides, no videos. You can help me in the comments, but uh, I pr but I please don't please don't spoil the game for me. I would like to figure some stuff out on my own. Um, but you can give me tip tips and, and, and odd stuff if you like. Uh, but for the most part, I have never seen anything. Uh, so uh, let's check out my options here. Uh, okay, this is good. What is reticle speed? Should I max that out? What is movement bob? What? Reset settings, execute- oh, that's to reset the settings, I think. What? I don't know what this is. I'm just gonna leave it at that for now. All right, did it save my settings? I hope it did. All right, so I don't have a file on here, so I'm going to just press a new game. Okay, it's gonna be English because I don't read Japanese and you guys wouldn't understand what anybody's saying anyway if I put it on Japanese and if I knew it. Okay. Wait, what? Gentle, kind, and mean? How bad is mean? What is gentle? Does it mean everything's nice in this game? What is the difference between gentle and kind? 
I'm just gonna go with this. Massive high school towers over all the other buildings uh, in this bustling urban area. It's like the school stands at the center of the entire world. Hope Peaks Academy. It brings in top students from every field imaginable. A government funded school of privilege. They say that if you come here and manage to graduate, you'll be set for life. With hundreds of years of, tr of tradition, it sends the cream of the crop into the workforce every year. It builds to raise hope in the nation's future, which makes Hope's Peak a, fi a pretty fitting name. There are two things you need to attend to school. One, you, ha you, you have to already be attending high school. Two, you have to be vi the very best at what you do. No ordinary student could enroll here. The only way is if you're scouted by the school itself. And standing there at the gate of the ultimate school filled with the ultimate students was me. Before we go any farther, I guess I should introduce myself. My name's Makoto Naegi. Uh, as you can see, I'm nothing but a hopelessly average high school student. Average on the outside, average on the inside. Good to know. I really don't have much going on for me when it comes to grades, special abilities, even personality. I mean, yeah, I have hobbies and stuff I like to do, but it's not like I'm a psychic or mutant or whatever. Like, if you ask me what my favorite song was or my favorite movie or TV show, they'd all just be whatever's most popular at the particular moment. Even among the average, I'm completely average, so I can't say I'm your everyday hero type. That's just who I am. Anyway, I figure it's always good to introduce yourself right off the bat. But you know, if I have any kind of strong point, so to speak, I am say I'm a little more gung-ho than other people. I mean, look at me. I'm completely ordinary, but still, here I am standing in front of anything but ordinary Hope's a Peak Academy. I still can't believe I'm standing here. I wonder if someone like me can survive in a place like this. It's got this overwhelming presence, like it's trying to swallow me whole. But it's no wonder I would feel that way. What you have to understand is, well, let me just tell you about the preparation uh, I did last night to get ready for today. Uh, okay, so what is this? Name anonymous, keep it coming. Apparently my friend knows him, guess you can start. What the heck are all these? Pro's gonna be there too, are these messages? Hope's Peak only invites those students who are the truly elite in their field. It's such a popular topic, there are threads online dedicated to talking about the school's attendees. So to prepare, I looked up some of these threads. And all I saw was talk about ultimate students, who were way beyond your average high schooler. Oh, there's some pretty looking people that are on my screen right now. For example, one incoming student is the ultimate pop sensation. I guess she's a high school girl who's also the lead singer for a pop group of fa famous all over the country. There's also the ultimate baseball star. He was the cleanup hitter for the national high school champs. Pro teams already have their eyes on him. He looks pretty furious for a baseball guy. Oh, oh look at her. She's the cutie right there. Then there's the ult ultimate fashion. Does that say Nyo Nyo on the head title of the magazine? Junko Enoshim? Enoshim? She's been on the cover of tons of fashion magazines. She's what every high school girl wants to be. Really? Do, do, does... never mind. Who the heck is that guy? Oh, and they mentioned the ultimate biker gang leader too. The scary thing is he's the de facto leader of every biker gang in Japan. Gangs everywhere love the guy. Well, I don't like him. Oh, well, just from his looks. On top of that, there's the ultimate martial artist, the ultimate fanfic creator, the ultimate gambler, the ultimate swimming pro, the ultimate programmer, the ultimate clairvoyant, and then some. Reading that made me realize how totally powerless I was. It was the country's finest top to bottom. I felt like a tame little house cat who'd wandered 
into a pride of lions. But still, there was something I couldn't stop thinking about. You see, there were a few students who I couldn't find any info on, no matter how much I look. With all those ultimate students, I'm the only one without any kind of worthwhile talent. But then, what about those other new students who didn't seem to pop up anywhere? Could they be just average students like me without any talent or anything? That that thought was kind of encouraging. I mean, I know I don't have much in the way of personality, but beyond that, there's an even bigger issue. How does such an unbelievably average student like me get picked to come to this ultimate high school? I mean, I guess there is a reason. You just have to take one glance at the acceptance letter they sent me to see why. Okay, I can I can I can read it from there, but I guess it's easier to read on the bottom. Uh, we recently held a lottery to select one ordinary student to attend our school. Really? As a result, you have been selected, and we invite you to join us at the Ultimate Lucky Student. They spelled it out plain as day. I got invited by pure luck. Can you all believe this? Honestly, I probably would have been be better off just declining their offer. But after hearing how graduating was a guarantee for success later in life, I just couldn't say no. Oh gosh. But then, actually standing there in front of the school, I started to feel lost. Like, I didn't belong there. I could I could feel myself losing my nerve. But still, I can't just stand here in front of this gate forever. Frozen place, murmuring to myself, I looked down at the acceptance letter, clutch in my hand. It said there'd be a meeting for all incoming students in the main hall at 8 a.m. The meeting still isn't for a while, but I should probably just head in. Yeah, let's do this. I gathered up all my determination and tried to act like I'd done this a million times before. No, you shouldn't do that. And I took my first step toward the main hall. This is where we're supposed to meet, right? I guess I'm the first one here. There's a really elegant clock over in the corner. It says it's 7.10 a.m. Oh man, 50 minutes early. How, man, this guy has a lot of determination. The meeting doesn't start until 8 o'clock, so there's uh, still a full 50 minutes left. It makes sense that nobody else would be here yet. I was so wound up, I got here way too early. I had plenty of time before the meeting. Just standing around waiting isn't exactly... I had to take a look around the school. Maybe that'll help me calm down a little. I am a student here now, so there shouldn't be any problem with me having a look around, right? It'll help it help me kill some time if nothing else. I'm trying to play it cool. I took my first step into Hope's Peak Academy. It was also my first step towards starting a new life at a new school. At least, that's what I was hoping for. What the heck just happened? Did everything just twist? But the instant I took my step, first step forward, my view became warped twisted. It was like some kind of delusion melting away and mixing together into something else. Spinning, mixing, melting away, then spinning again. This is not the kind of school I want to go to. Everything went black? And how life as I knew it came to an end. What? Already? It's not because I had ultimate good luck. It was so I could experience ultimate despair. What? Are you serious? What? Welcome to despair? What is this? Wait, I can save my game already? I haven't even played the game yet. Fine. Wait, I, 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 my head's down. I woke up with my head resting on top of a hard wooden desk. My body feels heavy. It's pretty normal for me to zonk off in the middle of some boring class or whatever, but what was I doing he asleep here just now? This isn't a classroom I've ever been in before. What the heck is going on? Uh, okay, so now we're off to tutorials. I can, what, where am I aiming at? If you aim at an object you can interact with, you can press that. And presto, you'll investigate that object. Okay, the, the D-pad or L and R to adjust my viewpoint. Uh, okay. Oh, okay, that's just a... Okay. 
about oh d-pad is also to do that okay and then there's help press that to observe what you're in oh i can exit the hallway uh okay That is a security camera. Is that a surveillance camera? It's a dangerous world we live in. I guess they have they have these to keep weirdos from just wandering in. Okay. And then what are these things right here? In any normal classroom, that's where a window should be, but it looks like some kind of metal plate has been bolted over it. And what if I knock on it? Is it to prevent students from like looking through the windows during class time? Okay, that's a sign. Can't look at the sign. What 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 what, what about the clock? It's already eight o'clock, dude. I I'm not even at the meeting yet. Is that a TV or a microwave? That's a TV, okay. School is funded by the national government, so I guess it's not its not that weird to have TVs in here. Something feels off, I wonder what it is. Okay, and that's a door. What? Is there more that I have to look at? What, what, where, what else am I trying to look at? More windows? It, it, okay, it says the same thing. Wait, what, it, what, what? What is this? What? I'm, I drool on the desk. Uh, orientation guide. Some kind of cheap-looking pamphlet. And there's some handwritten on it. The next semester is about to start. Starting today, the school will be your entire world. A joke? I got myself so wound up, I passed out in the main hall, and then someone carried me in here? If that's true, it must mean this is a classroom inside Hope's Peak. But then, if that's true, that just raises more questions. This is re all really strange. Those metal plates covering the windows, it's like a prison or something. None of this makes any sense. I should probably head back to the main hall. It's already past the meantime. There might be other students there now. Okay, well, thanks for letting me know. Wait, but then I see another note over here. Should I read this? I guess I should probably read this, like, right now. Uh, wait. I, but then I, but then there's multiple, I just said that for the other desk that I just looked at. Dude, it says the same thing. Okay, so I can examine more than one. Oh, oh, it's because I looked at it at, at a different perspective. That's why I thought that was the same desk. Okay. Can I, okay, so now can I leap through the door? Uh, oops, okay, hold on, hold on. Yes, okay. Now let's see what happens. This is the hallway? Why is it, why does it look different than the hallway that, that we just saw earlier? It's always kind of weird too. This is getting stranger by the second. I honestly have no idea what's going on. Well, for now, I'll just head to the main hall. Oh, now I'm moving? Is that what it is? Oh, I can run. Okay. Also, I can open up the map. And I can close the map. Okay. Oh! I'm moving! I'm moving! Okay. I'm gonna assume this is the classroom that I that I just came out of. Can I go inside here? Wait, wait, what? I wonder where this red door leads. I'm starting to feel sick standing here. Can I not go through that? All right, I guess not. All right, uh, in.
Uh, okay. What about this? What 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 is this right here? The AV room. It's locked. All right. Wait, why is that door open? Can I can I see what's in there? Why does it say keep out? The school store. I guess it's not open. Okay, so then why you put like, why you wrap it around with like yellow keep out tapes? That that makes no sense. Dude, the controls are really weird in this game. Wait, what? Mm -hmm.